Well, hello there, Real Gamers. Retro Rob here, and welcome to Retro Rob Plays Everything. And this, of course, is Coffee in a Game, the live version. Please note at the beginning of this that things can and do pretty regularly go wrong on this live stream. I do try not to swear during it. Uh, sometimes I'll let one slip out, though, because because in my home life, I'm basically basically a sailor, to be honest. Uh, so, you know, that's... Uh, that's what happens sometimes. But, but anyway, uh, today, as always, we have a vote. And uh, eh, there we go. Here's how it went. Lowest voted for was Pepper 2 on the ColecoVision. Um, yeah, that kind of makes sense. I don't do a lot of Coleco here, so I probably don't have a lot of audience that's into it. Uh, we've got Venture for the Atari 2600 coming in. Uh, with 21%, did respectably. And then we've got on the Steam Deck, Warhammer Inquisitor, which, uh, by the way, is a great game. So uh, so just note that one. I'll probably keep that one in the vote. Or at least do a Steam Deck play of it. And then finally, we've got today's winner, which is Walker Texas Ranger on the uh, Amiga Mini, which uh, I'm very excited to be doing a, a, a Texas uh, Texas based video game super glad really uh, so anyway we're gonna get to <laughs> we're gonna get to some gameplay here and uh i've got my amiga mini up and i've got my keyboard hooked up and my mouse and i gotta tell you guys this um this came really close to not happening i gotta tell you this one went down to the wire uh, because I had nothing but problems trying to get a version of Walker running. And it's kind of funny because I I ignored the um, the thing that was right in front of me, which is uh, the fact that I've got uh, an Amiga uh, Workbench version of the uh, SD card, which has Amiga Workbench on it. And it has a version that works just fine. So, thank goodness we've got that and it takes a minute or so to start up I might have made a mistake there because <laughs> I might have to plug in I didn't test that part interesting what's home gonna be nope what is home going to be? What I didn't test is this. Oh, okay. Well, hang in there. I didn't test this all down to the wire because uh, <laughs> I couldn't really. Give it a second here to pick this controller up. Hit A to start. There we go. It's home to start. I really wish that they would uh, get the mouse working in these menus. That would go such a long way to making this easier. One of the big complaints I have about this is it only has three ports. So if you're using the if you're using the joystick to go through the menu, and I'm I'm sure I can look up what the key is for it, but it, you uh, you lose that port because you're using the joystick. So if you got a mouse and keyboard plugged in, you're kind of hosed unless you use a hub, which I looked all over for my hub, wasn't there. All right, anyway, enough of my whining. Let's get this going. No, I have not finished the whole Atari Mania game yet. I was waiting for my friends. We've been playing that uh, as a group. And uh, three of my friends now have Ataris. They just they just got them during that last sale. So we'll probably get on to it. Okay, so let's do Walker Decrunched. I love this, by the way. This is just like old times. Other than I never actually had a hard drive on my Amiga. It was floppy only. Even as my friends were getting them. Heck no, I was going to use floppies to the end. Uh, 
This game I hear is pretty brutal, so. What F3? F1. Oh, what's it gonna be? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. What's it gonna be there? I have to wait till the last minute to do this. Hmm. That's funny. My F1 key isn't working. So, what am I doing here? I'm gonna have to wait till the very last minute to plug in that keyboard. There we go. It's a hackneyed way to do it. I really wish I would have found my uh, my hub. All right. Give it a second to identify the keyboard. Thus far, it has not. Don't tell me it's. Oh wait! Oh, wait! Ah! We got it. Wait. <laughs> oh, this is this is gonna be good. This is gonna be good. This is this is the most Amiga game I think you can play. <laughs> Area secure. You know, there was a game called Smurf Massacre on the Commodore 64. This reminds me of part of it. Oh, look at those planes. Kind of funny how it looks like you're missing even when you're hitting. So long, snipers. My shield appears to be okay, that's good. I was expecting all three of those guys to die, just so you know. Are, were they repelling? Is that what they were doing? <laughs> Get rid of those. Kind of curious to see what some of the other keys do. One does appear to walk backwards. Huh. Kind of curious to see the manual on this because I. It says lock off, and I wonder if there's a... Oh, there it is! If I right-click, I can lock on to people. Look at that. Got him. That's pretty cool. I think the trick is to lock onto that cannon. My shield is down. 
Warning. I got that guy. See, can I warm it up? Can the shield, can the shield be repaired? No. Apparently, what's down, it's down. I guess my biggest question right now is, can I? I wish I could aim my walker the other way, you know. I'm gonna lose a walker here. Ah, oh, there it went. They took it down. Do you hear that? They're talking in the back. They're. You hear like them talking, which is pretty cool. A lot of digitized sound in this. <laughs> Remember when uh, when digitized sound was a big deal? It's digitized sound. We digitized it. It's amazing. We took your voice and turned it into ones and zeros. Nowadays, we complain about the voice acting, you know? Different times, I tell you. Different times. Making choices here that will haunt me. There. Let that shield go up. I wish there were shield pickups. I haven't seen any. Ugh. Pitiful. My shield is now down. One more down. There we go. Come on. Squish. Why can't I squish them? Come on. I like how bodies fly out of the truck, too. Enemy units approaching. Engage and destroy. Oh, at least if I make it through a level, it'll, um, it replenish my shield, so I got that going for me.
Hmm. Well, I gotta destroy them all, I guess. There we go. Just staying out of range of most of them. Yeah, I think the graphics look really good on this. I'm guessing if I let this gun get into place, I'm going to regret it, so... Hey, how's it going, Brian? Come on. Let's go. Look at Look, it's a, it's a blimp. Wait, let's call it a dirigible. Did you see it? It was like up at the top. If I were a hipster, I'd call it a dirigible. But I'm gonna call it a blimp. Ah, oh, come on. Really? I hate this guy. Get it! Couldn't get a lock on him either. There we go. Got the popcorn. <laughs> I love the way he says die scumbags. Die scumbags. Is there an award for best acting in a video game? Because I think Whoever said die scumbags, that guy should get the award. Die scumbags. Look at that thing. Walked right into it. Ooh. Oh. Mistakes are made. Critical shields. I am indeed in trouble. And I love how it says we detect aerial targets and then there was nothing up there. First thing that comes up. Oh crap, really? Come on! Am I supposed to be targeting that thing? I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing here. Or whether I'm just supposed to attack... Oh, look at that! I did do damage to it. Why would you... Why would you send a giant helium-filled balloon after me? Or whatever is in those things. I don't think it's actually helium. <laughs> Come on. There we go. Oh, no. Good. 
Dunk, 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 dunk. Hey, Pong, how's it going? Sorry I didn't see you there. Oh, I locked in the wrong thing. There. One thing I will say is the, uh, this Amiga mouse is not too bad. Works really pretty well. I do not believe that there are... Uh, you do get a, a shield recharge after after you complete a level. So it does give you your shields back at the beginning of every level. Alright, this is Ariel. Oh, here it is. El Blimpo. Walked right into it. Ugh. What I'm trying to do is move close to him and then move away As he fires, so he'll miss me, but what's happening is I'm walking right into him when he fires, which is not very good gaming. You know? As far as I know, there are no... I don't recall ever getting any weapon upgrades. I think you just deal with what you got. This is... Now, you gotta remember, at the time this game was made, it was unique. There was not other games that were remotely like this, really. I'm trying to think if there was any... I think at the time this was made, there was, this is it. There, did enough damage that he got out of here. Oh, I heard it blow up in the background. You don't get to, <laughs> you don't get to see it blow up, I don't think. You just hear it in the background. Man, that's not the level end? Give me a break here, guys. Oh, he took it out. Darn it. Darn it, darn it, darn it. Come on. I'm really not doing an amazing job here. Now it'll come down a little bit, I think. Nope, not that time. I must have been really close to the end of uh, the level when I died. <sighs> really? I don't know if they're doing any uh, damage to my shields there or not. I'm kind of assuming that paratroopers do more damage to you, but I'm not 
I don't know that that is a fact at all. I mean, that makes sense. It wouldn't take too much to shoot a balloon out of the sky, right? I don't get why they don't give me shields. That should be the end of a level right there, don't you think? No, no, not in Walker, though. It's doing so much damage. I go, go, go. Oh, they got me. I knew it was going to happen. And that's it. Walker. <laughs> But I do. Oh, it's number one. Look at that. Oh, I feel feel pretty special on that one. All right, let's do uh, let's do one more run here. Oops, using the wrong mouse. Press fire, and then we'll uh, we'll wrap up after this one. Okay, F one easy. Now, here's the deal. Why don't I have F one? on here up oh, wait I think it was right control F1 right just walking what uh oh what's up with this Oh, there we go. Okay. Oh, wait. There must have been a lock there. All right. How's it going? I, I like the horses. There we go. Take that one out. So now I guess, uh, I, I guess as we get further on, I gotta consider the uh, trucks themselves to be high threat. Because that's how I got shredded last time. Utterly shredded up. Get the ones that are close to me. Oh yeah, they got mortars. Come on. Did not walk away fast enough from that. Nice. Got him. <laughs> yeah, right. That'd be a good scene in Choplifter, like, uh, if we could, if you, like, see a walker stamping around and you're trying to pick those guys up. <laughs> Come 
my, my shield's pretty chewed up already. Sometimes it feels like it takes a lot longer to shoot that, uh, truck down than other times. I don't know why. Good stuff. Shield is critical. No, oh, you're not getting set up. Come on. This game could use some continues, right? I think I smushed one of those guys. One of them. No, oh, this is not loaded on the unit by default. No, this was a side. This was a side load. Or do, I, I use it's a WHD load, and I've got the desktop on here, which makes life a lot easier. All right, see now, it's the beginning of the level, and my shield got regenerated. Destroyed. Oh, come on. That one little guy. One little guy. Oh, no. I'm pretty sure if that cannon gets out, it's going to be bad news, right? Finish them off pretty quickly. What the heck? Come on. Not willing to come out and play, eh? Two guys giving me trouble. <sighs> Fired on the wrong one. Well, well, I have good news because uh, I covered a game that is just like this called They Came From The Skies and you get to upgrade it. So there's um there's a game called the It Came from the Skies 2. Just I just covered it I think last week. And uh, it's basically this game. Again. <laughs> you do get to shoot down buildings though, which is kinda nice. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, come on. I don't want to lose one.
Hit me dead on. There. Didn't that time though. No, I am not. They make um they they make uh plug in um plug in devices that let you use a mouse and a keyboard uh for games that don't support it. I'm gonna imagine that's pretty Clearly, clearly he was causing trouble. Oh, my shield's down. <laughs> Die! I'm trying not to even let him get a hit on me, but that is proving very difficult. Yeah, this is going to be... Yeah. This is going to be a problematic level, I think. <laughs> I've never seen him be in real life. That was the first computer I ever bought for myself was the Amiga 500. There we go. He does actually that sniper does quite a bit of shield damage. There. Yeah, I wonder if they make one. They almost have to have made, um, there almost has to be like a GameCube uh, mouse and keyboard, didn't there? I'm thinking. I'll tell you. I think one of the things with the Amiga is the uh, it, it has a really excellent and large public domain library, and it's it was one of the larger demo scenes. So it's actually got well, I mean it absolutely has a lot of games, but it also has a lot of uh, PD stuff and interesting music demos. Ready? There, he's out of there. They're getting to do too, way too much damage. Way too much damage. Come on, dude. Yeah. Not good. Not good at all. What is that? Is 
This could not be good. This could not be good. It does not appear to take damage either. Come on. I'm like really leaning into this thing. It's just not dying. Oh no. No. That could not be good. Wow. Look at that! Los Angeles 2019! This would be the future to them. <laughs> Clearly they're in my hometown. Although it says Los Angeles, so... Maybe it's a mislabel. <laughs> Look at this thing. They are finally died. Goodness gracious. Helicopter down. That was cool. So I'm guessing this is supposed to be post-apocalyptic. Come on. Um. There he is. Got him. I was waiting for that one little guy, I think. I gotta say, the planes in 2019 are uh, much easier to shoot down than the one from like the 40s. How is this thing not dying? You see how many bullets I was pumping into it? <sighs> oh heck no. There. It's Airwolf! What? What are they doing? <laughs> oh, they're, they're trying to climb up me like in Star Wars. You see that? Yeah, absolutely. There was a physical, there was a physical release in this game. And at, well, I guess there was shareware at the time. So there was a lot of just playing public domain games. But this one actually, yeah. There was a boxed release for it. <laughs> there we go. Oh. Hey, do I not have as many points as I had in the last... Uh-oh. 
shield is down. There. <laughs> How many bullets, man? The chop lifter. It's the chop lifter. Yeah, I haven't seen him picking up anybody, though. This is going to get me killed. I can tell. Now back up. There, see? He can't get to me then. How about a little shield regen here? No, he's getting in. He's getting in. Ah, there he goes. Whew. <laughs> Those little guys going wild. Doesn't it sound like uh, the beginning of, uh, or well, actually, the refrain from uh, Batarang by Skrillex? <laughs> wow! Ba -ba -da -da. That's all I can sing of it, by the way, without getting a copyright strike against me, so. Or having to monetize the video with, uh... That really is Choplifter. I wonder if they were trying to emulate that. Ooh. Wow. Could I fail that anymore? What? Where did that bomb come? Oh, that did that bomb come out of that thing? I'm guessing it came out of the drop plane. You would not believe how many bullets that takes. Goodbye, popcorn. I love these things too, man. These things can take a beat down. Look at that. Oh. There. And then just get way away from them. Walk behind. There we go. So why is that one so easy to kill and some of the other ones are so hard? I mean, some of these are really super hard to kill. It's crazy. How are they not dying? There we go. See so that little shithead. Oop, there we go. <laughs> Still got that little crap head there. Swinging around. Get off of me! Look at him, he's still there. He's gonna get in. Oh, he got up. Uh oh. Come on. Shield's back up, so I made it through there. Yeah, right? I like that uh, that gradient in the back there. Get rid of the ground, guys. Snipers are gone. Then take this guy out. Easy stuff.
Oh, look at him. <laughs> That's awesome. And you thought hang gliders were just for tourists. There, now this guy goes out. Ha! Uh, I feel like I should have made it at this point, right? One down. Another one to go. There we go. For a second there, I thought they were little supermen. <laughs> uh, I gotta cling on. Got him. Eh. That one. Were those mines? Wait, am I? Ah, uh, I walked on some mines. Something laid mines down here. Did you see that? I missed that. Yeah, there we go. See? That's what I've been missing. Oh, crap. That's going to cost me. My lack of attention to detail just cost me right there. Yeah, that cost me. Okay, so now I know what they're doing. They're dropping mines, and I'm missing that they're dropping mines. That's what's getting me destroyed. All right, one more life. Let's see what we can do here with them. Come on. Die, die, die. Oh, uh, no, no. See? Jeez, it's like I cannot hit those things, you know? And I can't lock onto them. So you gotta be very careful. Get him. I think that part went pretty well considering how it went last time. <laughs> At 
Look at how much damage he's taking. Jeez. There we go. All right. I'm guessing what I really should be taking out is those. Where'd that car go? They can do quite a bit of damage too if they get to fire. I noticed. Sorry about that. Somebody got blocked there. Don't know why I thought that was an offensive comment. That's YouTube for you. Meanwhile, you know, porn bots run rampant. <laughs> Clearly, they're getting stronger. Oh, come on. What the heck? Why am I doing, like, no damage to him? There we go. I'm guessing you gotta do this in order, huh? There we go. I'm guessing I gotta destroy that launcher. Oh, that's it! Second boss got me. All right, and that wraps it up for <laughs> for Walker. Yeah, I think that held up pretty well. I agree, it would have been nicer if it had some more weapons, but I think considering the time period, which is you know the early '90s, it it was pretty good. Uh, it was okay to not have that. There wasn't a lot. I mean, there were games that had upgrades by them, but it wasn't a lot of them. Uh, I, I love the feeling of picking off lots of little enemy targets. Really good game. Definitely uh, definitely enjoyable and well and worth uh, downloading on your mini. Uh, note that I had a horrible time getting this game running. So uh, one thing you should get is there's an Amiga. There's a desktop uh Workbench really is what it's called on the Amiga, but there's a there's a workbench image you can get, and it actually has this game preloaded on it. That's definitely the way to go. Uh, it's you know it's free. You can get it, you can get it uh, on the net. Just look up a A500 workbench, and it'll come up. And then also uh, the other thing you'll need, of course, is a uh, is a thumb disk, and you need a fairly big one. I think I ended up putting a uh, 64 gig on here because it wouldn't fit on a 32 gig so just just note or no i did a 32 gig it was too big to fit on a 16 gig so make sure you get yourself a 32 gig one or use one that you already have it'll work fine i'm sure anyway i want to thank y'all very much for watching if you enjoyed it as always give a thumbs up subscribe for more thanks again and i will see you in a couple days